Of all the tributes written to the memory of the men of the USS Arizona, perhaps the most moving was penned by retired Chief Petty Officer Jack Langham. He titled it, Voice from the Arizona. It's time to break the silence I have kept for many years. I want to send a message to dry away your tears. Let my story be heard by mothers whose sons I still enfold, and to all the wives of loved ones who defended me brave and bold. To you who served in battleships, or perhaps you shipped with me. You might be mourning a shipmate who is resting beneath the sea. My story began in Brooklyn. 1916 was the date. They christened me Arizona after the sunny baby state. Oh, I was a proud ship, Arizona, and my commissioning became complete the day I took my place in line with the mighty U.S. fleet. My bow cleaved through the water. My sister steamed at my side. I was part of the greatest navy that ever graced a tide. If you have been a son of mine, you have helped me earn my fame. You serve me well and faithfully, and I'll always cherish your name. The years sped by, too fast it seems, and this lady was growing old. That infamy of Pearl Harbor my destiny did unfold. That tranquil Sunday morning found me secured in battleship row. Then without a sign of warning, I suffered my first blow. My crew rushed to battle stations and valiantly began to fight. The aggressors came on relentlessly. Attack! Attack! with no respite. My boilers blew with a resounding blast and the bomb dropped down my stack. The magazines were next to go. A blow broke my back. Colors flying. A last salute and with twisted and burning steel I gave in to merciful waters and felt mud engulf my keel. Now... I rest beneath the waves, embracing my beloved crew. Almost the entire complement. One thousand, one hundred, and two. Though our worldly days are over, don't for a moment be misled. The spirit within me is still alive, kindled by the gallantry of my dead. We receive your prayers and tributes. We hear you toll our bell. We thank you for your reverence much, much more than words can tell. If we could ask one thing of you, our sole request would be, do everything within your power to keep our nation strong and free. <laughs> 